Brian Err started with karate at the age of eight. As I was progressing, I realized how much I enjoyed competition. The people that I would meet through these experiences and then just one thing led to another. Growing up in Newfane and competing out of Lockport, the results started to speak for themselves. Through his teen years, he was winning national titles and was a bronze and silver medalist at the Pan American Championships. He began to realize bigger things were ahead. I guess when I made the transition from junior team to senior team, so that 18 to 20 year old, old range, um, that was kind of the time when things become real, like, okay, I'm not, a, I'm not a kid anymore. Now at 31 years old, Brian Err is a man to be reckoned with in the sport. Two years ago, he moved to Texas to train and compete among the best in the world with hopes of becoming an Olympian. I've always felt um, motivated in underdog situations. So at any time where I was competing against an opponent who was maybe faster than me or stronger than me or more experienced than me, that, I felt like that was my time to shine. That was my chance to prove myself. Prove himself, he has. He took gold this past summer at the Pan Am Games and is now ranked 13th in the world in his class. With the sport added to the Olympics, he's on the cusp of qualifying for this summer's games in Tokyo. He's doing all the right stuff. Uh, so I'm, I'm very excited, not only in the potential uh, qualification process results, but actually in his, his ring performance when he's actually competing. So he, he's right where he needs to be. Uh, we just need to get a couple more solid wins under our belt and, and we're golden. That word golden, something that Brian Err allows to cross his mind as he thinks about competing as an Olympian, fittingly in a country that karate calls home. The Budokan in Tokyo is, is the home for karate in, in Japan, so it's just very poetic the way it has all come together. This is a huge deal. Uh, karate has been right there at the cusp of Olympic sport for a couple decades, and people have been looking forward to this opportunity for, for years and years. That's always the, the dream, and that's the goal. Um, but like I said, not focusing too much on the finish line, just focusing on each step along the way.